Okay. So uh, next, I want to show uh, some other functions that is provided by AutoCount on the e-invoice. So uh, actually now, as you can see from my screen, I've uh, created a lot of uh, draft invoices. So sometimes you might think, hey, I need to click into the invoice and approve one by one. It will be troublesome. So what can we do is uh, we actually provide a function called batch approval. So we can switch to the draft tab. Okay, this function is available in our draft tab or awaiting approval tab. Okay, so once you see all the draft document over here, you can actually check all and approve. Okay, or you can select by certain uh, customer. For example, let's say I can filter. I want to approve only uh, those that is from AutoCount. So I can actually multi-select. All right, just hold your shift button. Okay, I show it again. Hold your shift button and click, let's say from the, the first one to the third one. So I can hold my shift button and I click over here. It will select these three. Okay, let's say I cancel off the uh, selection, the filter. You can see it only selects these three. All right. Let's say if you want to only uh, approve selected one, you can also hold your control button and tick whichever that you want. All right, so there's two ways, uh, three ways actually. The first one is you can check all. Okay, the second one is you hold your uh, shift button. Let's say I want to approve this one until this one. Okay, and the third way is selected, selective one. You can hold your control button to make, uh, to do the tick. So let's say now I want to approve all my uh, draft invoice. I just tick check all. I click approve. So a dialog will show. Okay, so this one is to start your approval. This one is uh, useful if you have a lot, a lot of uh, draft invoices that you want to approve. But if you have a little bit, you can just uh, very simple, just click start. It will start the approval. As you can see, uh, it will slowly went off one by one because all will go into our approve tab so all will be waiting for submission so let's refresh as you can see ah it's very quick that all these e invoice get validated so let's move on to our my invoice portal we can refresh ah so you can see a lot of 50 ringgits invoices being submitted over here which is the one that i approved just now Okay, so this is uh, some fancy, nice function that you can use in AutoCount if, let's say, you have a situation where you need to approve a lot of uh, invoices.